the whole week. Well, we just, uh, you know, went to our playmakers. You know, uh, number 11 there, uh, Antonio Gandy Golden, is only a sophomore. On third down, it's picked off. This should be a touchdown. There goes Turner. Welcome to the game, Chris Turner. Uh oh, miscommunication. Calvert trying to make something out of nothing, and he might. He's got a touchdown. A busted play results in six. Liberty with a shocker in Waco. What an absolute stunner. time FBS school until 2019, but that didn't stop him from beating Baylor. The win was Liberty's fifth win all time against an FBS team, and it was their first over a Power 5 team. The previous four came against Sunbelt and MAC teams. And the hero of the day, Flames QB Stephen Calvert, who had a new school record 447 yards in the air, including a 26-yard touchdown to Spencer Jones, which put Liberty up 10 points with 6-12 to play. And we are very pleased to have Liberty quarterback Stephen Calvert joining us this morning on Sports Center AM. Hey, man, how, how, how have the last four days been for you, man? They've been so much fun. Um, you know, just coming in, uh, the campus has been great. So much um, people just coming up and giving you uh, support. Um, you know, just getting, not not letting it get to my head, but... You know, just keep on my focus and, and, you know, just stay in focus. And then, you know, it's a great time to be a Flames right now. You know, I, I got to ask, I got to get this out of the way, because your middle name is Buckshot, right? Yes, ma'am. So, so they call you Buck. I think that's fitting. What, what's the story behind the nickname? Um, that's actually my middle name. Uh, it originated from my father, you know. He's a big NASCAR uh, guy. He grew up watching it, he loved it, and former NASCAR driver Buckshot Jones. And, you know, growing up, he just wanted something that would um, stick out and something that would uh, catch people's attention when it come to playing sports. And, you know, I feel like he's done a pretty good job with that. I, I think so. I, I yeah. need a better middle name, don't I? <laughs> well, he's a, he's, a little, he's a little more accurate than Buckshot, too. Like that, you, got more of a, you got more of a sniper thing going at the quarterback position. I, I want to ask you, President Falwell gave you guys, the whole school, from what we understand, no class on Monday. So how did you get loose in Lynchburg on Monday? <laughs> uh, it was pretty much a normal routine. Uh, just came in. Uh, to the FOC football facility, took an ice bath, um, went upstairs, watched a little film on this week's opponent, and then he, just like a normal kid would, go back to my dorm, chill with, uh, hung out with a couple of uh, teammates, and watched a couple movies. Hey, Stephen, at what point in the game did you know you guys could do this? I mean, coming in, the whole week of practice, we had the mindset of, you know, not letting a big name school get to our heads. We got to stay focused. And then just from the first snap, uh, we felt like we could do it. And the team really came together and we really grew as a unit. And, you know, from that first snap, we, we felt like we could um, hang with them and put up a good fight. And we did. Real quick, Stephen, um, many people I think probably had to Google and say, wait a minute. Where's Liberty? And, and, what, and what is their story? That said, you just took down and one of, the, one of the greatest upsets ever. Can you describe what it means to this football program that, that you're now helping give a name to? I mean, it means so much for this program. Uh, it's an honor to be part of it. Um, you know, the coaching staff, they work so hard with us. And, I mean, they, they love us so much. It's just an honor to be uh, playing underneath them. And, you know, we love the game of football. It's what we do. And, you know, just because a school has a big name or something or more scholarships than us doesn't mean that we can't give them all we got. And, you know, we love the game of football. So every game we're going to go out and play like it's 110%. And we're going to try our best. All right, FCS National Player of the Week, Big South Offensive Player of the Week, Stephen Calvert, congrats. And uh, best of luck and best of health moving forward. Stephen Buckshot Calvert. Thank you so much. There you Good go. Good stuff. Congratulations. <laughs>